Now, let us inspire each other to do more. Help me welcome Mr. Mark Anthony Arkayan, Bachelor of Science in Mechanical Engineering and the Class Valedictorian. My respect to VSU President Edgardo E. Tolin and our equally distinguished VSU officials, fellow graduates, parents, and my co viscans a pleasant day to all of you. Six years ago, I delivered my high school valedictory address in front of our school's ruined administration building. This was the time when Super Typhoon Yolanda hit our beloved region. I don't need to explain to you how this tragedy affected our lives because I think most of us know this story very well. Today, I'm humbled to do another valedictory speech in a time of another crisis. This time, the tragedy that we are facing is global with its economic impact so immense that millions lost their jobs and hundreds of thousands lost their lives. At some point, it made me think and reflect of how challenged my generation is. But instead of losing hope and succumbing to despair, here we are still standing up, picking up the pieces and are attempting to build our dreams because we know that there are many opportunities that we can still explore despite of our current plight. Six months after locking ourselves into our respective homes because of COVID-19, we lost so many things in the process. We had to cut short our remaining classes. We had to leave VSU and miss the sceneries of our campus. We even lost the opportunity to bid our dear batchmates goodbye, and you will relate to this. We were even deprived of a face-to-face -face graduation because we need to secure our safety including the welfare of everyone. But I think the most difficult thing that we are faced right now, being the so-called pandemic batch of graduates, is on how we are going to start our respective careers when everything around us is very unstable, uncertain, or worse, crumbling. How will we even land a job when a lot of people are losing their own jobs? What do we do in a time when you are asked to compete with those who lost their jobs and are more experienced than us being fresh graduates. Don't fret my fellow graduates because even if it seems that our future is quite blurry, we are never hopeless because we are capable of turning this pandemic into a possible window of opportunity. Now let's get back to the ultimate question. What can we do then as VSU COVID-19 batch? Let me give you my answer as a mechanical engineering graduate who learned the principles of design, analysis, and project implementation. This is what I'm going to do. While I'm on no way a medical professional, I know that my profession can contribute something in the global battle against this pandemic. Mechanical engineers can prevent the spread of COVID-19 by designing and developing machines that will ramp up production of testing kits while also improving logistical challenges to distribute them quicker. We engineers can also prevent future outbreaks like this pandemic by assessing our current medical equipment that will be required in the future in similar public health situations. You see, I was able to come up with possible things where I can contribute being a graduate of mechanical engineering here in VSU. My challenge to you, my fellow graduates, is this. How do you think can your field of specialization will help in the fight against COVID-19? And how will it contribute in preventing similar pandemics from ever happening again? You will be the best person to answer this question because you know your field better than I do. By answering this important question, I believe that you can plot the best track for your respective careers. I therefore challenge you, my co-graduates, to make sense of this question while you are submitting your resume to your future employers. This may even be a possible question raised to you when you qualify for different job interviews. While it is undeniable that our future is much more uncertain than the previous years, my batchmates, I know that we are capable of turning this difficult situation into a wonderful opportunity. Yes, we can make it. Always remember that you are a Viscan. And yes, you can. Thank you very much for this wonderful opportunity to share my thoughts with you. Stay safe, my fellow COVID-19 batchmates.
together, we will make this world a better place because we survived one of the most challenging times in our history. God bless us all. Congratulations on your success, Mr. Mark Anthony Arcayan, class valedictorian and would-be mechanical engineer.